Hello, it's Christina Rowe here from Standout Media Group, and I'm going to show you today how to do something really cool. Actually turn a blog post into a video instantly within minutes, and we're going to just do this live. So what I'm using, the tool I'm using is L-U-M-E-N-5, um, lumne5.com, and it has they're different pricing, but you can also do a free account. So I'm going to go over first to one of my blogs. This is the Addiction 911 blog. And what I did was on this blog post I just put up, and I'm just going to continue reading. This is actually an email that I sent out um, inviting uh, addiction professionals to become a panelist on the show for a show we're doing next week. So I just basically copied and pasted in, into a blog post. And now what I'll do is I will get the URL for this blog post and I'll actually go and drop it into Lumine. So the first thing I'm going to do is going to go to my dashboard. Okay, and this is one recent video that I did. Create video. And it says, let's make a video out of your blog post, which is super cool. So enter an article link to get started or you can copy and paste your content. So I'm going to go back over here and I want to grab this URL. Now I have on this a redirect, so I'm wondering if this is going to work because I have a, a, it all going to the Diction on one blog. So I'm not getting the full URL here, but I can log in on the back end and get it if for any reason that happens to you with your blog. Um, I can go to the actual site and I'll just log in and grab that actual URL. So I'll go here to my posts. Normally it should have the long link there just because of the way I have this set up. And I want to go to view. And here you go. So it says we would love to. This is the full link. Have you on the show next week. I take this and I just drop it in here and let's see what happens. Create. So now it's loading the article and it's creating a storyboard. So what we're going to do is I'm going to keep clicking here and then I'm going to actually just highlight the text here. Uh, let me move this up. You can move this up if this happens here like this. And I'm going to add that there. And for some reason, let me get rid of this one in the middle. And then I'm actually going to even have to add this. You just go like this. And then I'm going to go like that. You see how easy this is? Now, this happens every so often where you go over the actual count. So how to fix this is, um, as you know, many accident levels are confused return for treatment. Um, and then I'm just going to take this out. I'm going to put, so it goes on the next frame and I'll go like that. And then I'm going to go grab that. And I can see a little error here. So I'm going to go like that. Again, I'm a couple of things over. Okay, and I'm just going to grab this half of the sentence. I'm going to delete it. Put a little continuation dots here. And you're going to just see how absolutely easy this is to do. Uh, scroll down a bit. You can do this with any blog post. So um, it's again, it's going to do, it's kind of like Twitter where it's giving you the characters. And then I'm just going to pull this out so it makes sense. And you'll see in a minute when it creates the video why it's doing this. Um, so I'll add another one and then I'm going to click this one in here. Okay, and let me grab this one right here and so on. Again, I'm over here. Um, Tens of thousands of people who can actually interact with your files live and in real time. I'll pull this out. So this is the only thing that's a little bit annoying with this is that you have to do this, but you'll see this is the effects that they give you and stuff in here are really cool that, um, especially when you can do this for free for video. So you'll, you'll see that in a moment. Okay. And I'm going to go down here and this is one thing off. So I'm just going to get rid of the period there. Phone number and then I'll post it to the replay. Uh, which will be broadcast on and I'm going to grab this whole thing here again going like that and I'm still over so let me put this in here and I'll grab some more 
Uh, let's see, replay, I'll grab this. I don't know if that's going to be enough. So if your paragraphs are really long on your blog post, you'll be doing a lot of this. If they're short and broken up, um, you'll be fine. Let's see. Let's see if we can get this and kind of see that now is not, still not good. Okay, each pile has a chance to give the kind of, and that information. Let's see if we can get, now this one, this might have to go into three. So we put the dot, dot, dot. That one's good now. And this one's already over. So this is going to go into three. Uh, let's see if we can just grab this. And this is, like I said, this is all going to make sense once it turns into a video. Okay. And I'm going to do the next one here. And this one. And let's see. We're almost done here. Let's see. Uh, let's see if it pulled up any more here. Okay. Okay. So I think this is the end. I don't know if it pulled the entire thing in. So you want to double check and go back to your blog post to make sure that it pulled everything in. Okay. It did not pull this last sentence in. Um, so I'm going to put this in, just go back, add this here. And then I'm going to just add one more here for the rest with the link. And then I'm going to create it into a video. Okay, so let me just grab this here. Grab this URL. And we'll drop that in here. Okay, so now I've got all the text in here. I'm going to go over here to continue. And now it's going to actually start generating it into an actual video. This is a, just a super cool tool. And you're, you're going to see why, because if you were to actually try to make a video like this and take your blog posts and put it into PowerPoint slides and separate them all and then put the effects and put it into a video, it would take hours. Um, this is just amazing, this tool, that this does this so fast. And the reason we want to do video is video right now is very um, important, especially on Facebook, especially if you post on your Facebook page, because uh, Facebook can actually track the people that are viewing your video, which is super cool. And you can actually have them um, uh, then retarget ads to them. And LinkedIn just allowed native uploads, which meaning you could upload directly to LinkedIn and get much more views, which we're going to do with this one. Okay, so now here you can see it's got like the highlighted colors and stuff too. Um, and if I go down, you can see it's all, I could leave it like this to make the video, or I can go and add some photos. And it says search millions of copy um, copy free media right here and they actually give you some suggestions of some different videos here it's pulling up some addiction photos as you can see um, so normally I could do that I could stick some photos let me see it's even got stuff from wow oh because it's picking up some keywords in here okay so if we're gonna do let me see and there's actually you can even insert little videos which is really cool so let me see if we can find something that would um, would make sense. Let's see. Let me add. I could add this over to here uh, if I wanted to, like that. Um, and then, uh, but then it's going to be hard to read this text here. So let me see if I can actually get rid of this. I don't want to delete the whole slide, but that's that might be what I might have to do. Let's see. Yeah, it actually did. Okay, it doesn't even matter. We're going to just start it from here. Okay, so I could leave it like this, or I can start adding pictures in the background. And if I were to put in, um, let's see, addiction, which I think it already has a lot of stuff in here. Let's just see what comes up. Yeah, again, the same sort of pictures here that if I wanted to, uh, I don't think I want to add these in for this. So I'm not going to add any photos in the background, but I'm going to look at this and see uh, what else I'd like to do with this. So I'm going to go down and I'm going to look at this text here and I can actually click on it if I want to make any adjustments. If I want to change the position of the text, I can do this, which is pretty cool. I can actually um, change it to a quote, no text, a title, and do all of that here, which is really neat. Um, and Next, what the, I'm just going to leave it. Let me go all the way down. Just leave it like this. It's going to be a two-minute video. 
this one I do want to share here. This one I think I want to get rid of. I don't know what this is in the back. Okay, that's upload, watermark. I'm just going to put that image that I had before here. There we go. Let's see if that works. And if it doesn't, what I can do is actually un take this off so it doesn't show anything. So let's see how that works. Let's wait for this to load. And then if I also I want to change the color. I had used the hot pink in a previous video. And I'm going to uh, actually, you know what, I'm not going to put the watermark. I'm going to take that off. And I'm going to take this logo off here. I'm going to change this highlight color because um, in this particular branding I'm using a lot of red. So I'd like rather put some red in here. Well, it's a little too orangey, so I want to find a good red possible up here. Here we go. There we go. Perfect. Okay. Um, we're not using this in the back, so I'm just going to leave leave that and share this video. I want to see if I can actually take a and one of these. And you can add actual slides to here too. If I can actually take the photo and bring that photo back to this last thing. So here's how it would look with the black and the right. So I'm going to go back over here to the media and I'm going to look at my uploads. Let me upload a photo and let me get that photo over here again. Let's see if we can get this for the last slide. Okay, continue. And now it's going to upload and let me see if I can drag it over to the last slide where it says share this video. Okay, and then I'm going to do it and just drop it in here. And uh, hopefully, nope, that's not working. Okay, and I'm wondering why. Okay, uh, let's just delete this. And actually, it's not even allowing me to delete it, which is interesting. Share this video. Displayed in the last scene of the video. So I guess maybe it's not going to allow me to put a picture here. Um, it's, let me see if I upload the, this as a logo. And let's see if that works. So we're just playing around with this here and let's see what happens. If you have a small logo, you can just put this here. This may not work, but we'll just try it anyway. And this displays in scenes icon as the background. This is a different color you can use or you can use a recommended color here as well. There we go. All right, that's perfect. So I've got that there. Share this video. And now this video, and I'm going to leave it very simple. I'm going to go over here to music. And if I want to play a little music on this, I can, or I can just leave it so there is no music. So let's see. Um, we don't want anything funky. Happy. Let's see how this sounds. No, it's a little too, too corny. Let's see if there's anything. Here's another. Nope. So you can kind of listen and see these are like kind of silly, uh, dramatic. No, you see the mood of it. Hmm. That one might be okay. Sunshine. Um, let's just add that one. I think let me just try this one real fast. No, that's too silly. Let me just play this one more time. Okay, and I'm going to just click on it. And you can even look by mood here too. So you can do all this this here to find the right mood. Angry, bright, calm, dark. <laughs> Let's look at calm, see? Here's some calm ones. And you could do do stuff like that. Okay, so we already have this selected. So next let's go to continue. All right, and it says I'm about to publish. Oh, I just pressed publish. I guess it plays the music for you. So now the magic happens. Now it's actually rendering this and this is actually making this into a video. So let's watch and see what happens. So it's got about five minutes remaining. So I'm going to let that go and then come right back once it's done and we can play the video and see exactly how it works. Okay, so my video is all ready. So let's take a look and see how it came out. Click on, there we go. OK, 
Okay, I'm going to pause this. I'm going to have to watch the entire thing. Let's just go to the end and see how that picture came out. And there you go. So now um, I can upload this to Facebook and I can also download it. So I can download it and save it to my computer, which is the first thing that I'm going to want to do. And I want to show you just on LinkedIn right now. Um, this is a video that I did, the other one. This one's much more fancier. And just so you get an idea, I did add all photos in here. But since we were doing this live, I just wanted to make this one quick for you. So this is one here that the photos came up and I was able to put. So I'm going to play just a second of this for you just to show you. I actually were able to add video in the back, which is really cool. So you can see this one's a little fancier. Now look down here, 435 views of this video on LinkedIn. There was no advertising for this, absolutely free. And I had six likes on this, so definitely worth it. So now let me just go, now the one we made right now is not as fancy as that one obviously, but it's fine. So let me go and put, post it. Let me go to home and let me show you how to post it. So now that my video is already and downloaded, I'm gonna click on video. I'm going to grab my new video, I'm going to stick it here, and I already have some text here to save time about it. Uh, let me put the URL here. Oh, that's not the right one. So this way people can register. Okay, so now this is public. I can actually even go public Twitter on this and boom, just post it. And that's done. And now that's going to upload, it's going to process, and this is just uploading organic video. It used to be that you could only upload video from uh, to LinkedIn from like YouTube putting the URL. So now you can do it and process it here and it, it works very well. So I can go back here to Lumine, um, Lumine, Lum lumen5 <laughs> and I can upload to Facebook so I can just pick to see where I want to do it so I'm going to upload it to the addiction 911 show here and I'm going to say something about this video and I've got to put a title and let's see what I have here at the beginning I'm going to grab some of this beginning stuff here and let me grab the first sentence to put as the title okay I'm going to grab this here And then I'm going to stick it here and I'm putting this on a page. This way Facebook can track the views. And I'm just going to upload it. So very, very easy to use. Again, this website, as you can see here, lumen5.com. It's free. There is some paid options. If you want to remove, I guess we upgrade to pro, you'll get different pro features that you can do even more with. Um, but this is a really great way to churn your blog posts. Go and get those old blog posts and just start turning them into videos. It's a really a fantastic marketing tool that you can use for this and um, it's super e easy to use. And like I said, you can use the free version or you can check out some of them. I haven't even checked out myself the, the different uh, upgrades for Pro, but I mean, I'm impressed already with what they have here. Uh, and there's actually even, I guess, some templates that you can use too. And these welcome to smart templates. And you can actually use templates too, which is pretty cool. Um, wow, these are intelligently crafted video templates based on your blog post to help you get started. So you can actually add your blog feed for here and actually get some some of them just to go in directly and uh, pull up the blog posts. So this would be where you'd find um, your feed here and you'd enter it in here and you'd be ready to go. So that's the tip for today. I hope you take this tip and use it. It's a really great tool. It takes only a couple of minutes. Um, I think I've made this whole video in under 20 minutes and definitely worth doing and turning those blog posts in, um, into videos. I'll see you soon.